Kevin here on behalf of Simple Tech Reviewers. Uh, we're back again. Sorry about the delay. It's been a busy three months of finishing school and stuff and work. So I haven't been able to make videos. So I do apologize. But today we're coming at you with a installation and review of the Cree LED headlights. Uh, now these LED headlights are supposedly as bright as HIDs but last longer due to the LED technology. Now LED stands for light emitting diode and what it uses instead of HIDs, instead of using a gas, it's just uh, pretty much uh, the newest lighting technology um, simplified into a headlight enclosure. So on this unit we got a fan in here that cools the LED even though they uh, are not supposed to get hot I guess uh, Inputting 20 watts into both of these will create some heat. So there's a fan in there. Here's your standard 9006 connector. Uh, I'll be installing this on a Lexus SC300. And without further ado, let's get to the installation. All it came up was um, just the two bulbs. No ballast needed. Uh, LEDs use much less power, so no ballast is needed. And by the way, this brand is made by Cree. Uh, I heard it's one of the better brands for LED lighting. And yeah, let's get into uh, part two of the video. Okay, on to part two of the video. I'm going to be showing you the installation. Uh, we're doing the passenger side, so this is the right side of the vehicle. Hope you guys can see. I think I angled it so you can see. So here's our uh, headlight bulb. You can see right there. First thing you want to do, it's pretty easy, uh, unplug the cable and simply just twist to the right and the 9006 bulb should come out. And here you go, it's just one of those cheap eBay Xenon bulbs, pretty yellow. Um, I'll, I will be putting a comparison up in a bit here after I install one of them so give me a second on that you want to take your new LED headlight and pretty much you just insert and twist to the left and you just use the existing harness uh, if I can find I just dropped it out oh, here. Here we go, and it's just plug and play, direct plug in, no ballast to mess around with, and it just sits like that. Pretty much, you can now you can tuck it off to the side, make it look a little neater. That's pretty much it. it just pops, sticks out a little more. So, uh, if you have a car that has clearance issues close to the headlight, I would be aware of that before purchasing these headlights. Uh, the air box here, we have a good what inch and a half there, so we're good to go. Uh, so stay tuned for part three of the video. It's coming up. All right, part three of the video. Um, as you can see here, there is a huge difference. I don't know if it's as noticeable in the video, but I'm getting uh, a much brighter light now compared to the so-called xenon bulbs from eBay. So we got the xenon bulbs to the left there on the driver side, and we got the Cree LED 6500. K by the way LED bulb and that faint sound you hear is the fan running already now it looks kinda bluish in the video but I I do assure you that these are white they're bright white they're not blue at all blue would be in the 8000 to 10,000 K range of temperature but these are definitely really bright much brighter than stock uh, that's stock again, and there is the LED. Again, it looks blue in the video, and do apologize for that, for not giving an accurate comparison. This looks white, but it's actually yellowish. And next to that is the daytime driving light, which is also LED. So that's bright, uh, completely white, and that's yellow, but it looks white in the video, so... Yeah, and there's the comparison. Uh, overall, I'm pretty satisfied with the purchase. Again, you don't have to mess with balances or anything. 
Um, compared to HIDs, they do last longer than HIDs. I've had HIDs in the past on this vehicle and they do burn out in 6 to 12 months. So, And these are supposed to last about 20,000 hours. That's what they're rated at. There's actually a little bit of noise due to the fan. But yeah, overall very satisfying. I'm going to do the other side and um, we'll do a follow-up video to give you some driving impressions at night and whatnot. Again, thanks for watching, guys. This is Kevin on behalf of Simple Tech Reviewer signing out. Please subscribe, comment, rate, uh, tell us what kind of videos you guys want to see. And yeah, we'll catch you soon. Later.